Hello everybody, in this video we'll show you how to use two cameras on whatnot and switch between them like a pro. One method takes 60 seconds and only two phones, the other unlocks picture-in-picture -picture HD webcams and OBS hotkeys. Let's dive into it. So, live commerce analyst reports that listings with a dedicated product camera boasts around three times the sales that a normal a camera would have for a single angle because single angle because buyers trust when they can see their own product in crisp detail. Also, Reddit sellers echoed that viewers won't bid if they can't examine corners clearly. So mastering dual angles isn't cosmetic. It's real money. So the very first thing you can do is go to the whatnot seller hub and, you know, you want to make your rear camera on your phone, your broadcast camera, and keep a second phone or something else as sort of the controller. So on a phone, you can open the WhatNot app, or you can go to desktop right here, like I have right here. Go to Seller Hub. So if you don't know how to get to that, uh, just go to WhatNot.com, and then go to the top right, so this profile. And then from here, go to Seller Hub. And then from here, what you want to scroll down to is you want to go down to shows. If you don't know how to connect your um, show to an OBS, like what I'm using to record this, then I made a tutorial about this. You can watch this after this video ends, um, but just watch this right now. Just click create show. And, um, you know, you probably already know how to do this, but you know you just want to put your name in. You want to choose a category, and there's some that are optional, like the tags, the moderators, the thumbnails, the preview videos. And after that, you just want to click schedule. And then what you can do to test the show is you can open it. And yeah, even though these these are canceled, it'll be the same thing for you if you scheduled it. Just open the show, and now you can connect this to your OBS account. And let me revert back to my OBS account because from here you can start auctions, you can start pin giveaways and rechat on phone B while phone A streams hand free. So because the devices talk over your Wi-Fi, there's no perceptible delay and you're locked into mobile sensors. So essentially you can't overlay logos uh, and you can't do picture in picture if you need CRISPR glass or want to cut uh like a TV director set up to OBS. So I'm going to actually enable my OBS overlay right here. Apply. As you can see, I have OBS right here and I have one camera, right? But what's really cool is you can connect to your um, iPhone. There's many, many ways to have your phone as a camera source that you can connect to OBS. And you probably thought like, wait, what? This is Apple. This is no way I can like third party it to uh, OBS. And yes, this is a perfectly safe and legal way. It's always been safe and legal. I'm just saying that you might have been surprised that you can do this. Um, I use this app. Uh, you might have heard of it called Epoch Cam. I think it's disabled uh, on the App Store right now, but it, as, it there's many, many ways to get this. Just search up how to connect phone to um, as a webcam. And as you can see, I have my camera linked to the OBS. So what you want to do is you want to click add and then you want to click video source. You want to click OK. And then from there, I'm going to click my Elgato virtual camera. And let's see, is it Let's see, is it there? Uh, one sec. As you can see, I have it enabled right here. Um, and as you can see, it's pretty good quality. iPhone is really, really an underrated webcam because you probably think, oh, I had to buy this webcam that's integrated and you know a USB integrated C9220. But no, actually your iPhone or your whatever phone, your Android serves just as a viable webcam as a normal webcam would. And yeah, people think the advertising is what actually makes the camera better, but that's not true at all. So once you have it connected to a video source, um, right now I have no idea why mine is not connecting. But um, I showed you right there, it's connected through the app. You just need something as a phone and then you can have uh
like you can use your iPad as a controller as you have two cameras and people on whatnot really appreciate the effort your sellers appreciate when you put effort into the setup for your live streams and just the logistics on how you show and present all of the products and from there people just want to essentially appreciate their product more like i said in the beginning like a crisp um better way to live switch and let me go back to whatnot if obs hiccups uh oops if obs hiccups that's probably not your fault because sometimes you just need to double check the stream key that whatnot provides to you and yeah you're thinking like how do i connect two cameras on a mobile device well yeah I would recommend using a computer because, like I said, you can connect mobile devices to your computer and use them as webcams. And it doesn't you don't need a high-end computer at all because OBS has been here forever and the open broadcasting studio has been open source and many, many people worked hard to make it accessible on many hardware platforms. So, you know, if OBS won't connect, regenerate the stream key, there's a mistype spaces, and the number one culprit is that and if the epoc cam or whatever your camera and make sure the application doesn't freeze and you can also toggle airplane mode off and back on and wi-fi corrupts current ndi packets so muting every unused audio source in obs double audio kills when especially if you have two cameras the two cameras you want to make sure are mute and you know aren't uh, having two microphones to each other unless you're far away because then there's going to be just this feedback echo and, you know, just make sure there's a test show like this. You want to put a private test show so that there's no hiccups that don't cost biz. You know, you want to make sure you're doing it before, before it goes into the real world. So, like I said, live commerce studies show clearly that multiple angle, angle demos are table stakes in Asia's $400 400 billion dollar live shopping market i didn't mean to say 400 dollars sorry and western platforms like whatnot are racing to match these engagement rates so yeah now you know uh that you can also go to show tools go here make sure your websocket server password it's it's kind of it's actually a little bit difficult at first to set it up on obs so uh, don't get too frustrated. Uh, uh, you're not alone. Um, you also can stream upcoming shows right here. Um, but yeah, happy streaming and may your bid climb sky high with the two camera setup. Bye.